sometimes in cow and calf rearing uh, when you're bringing up a baby cow there's always this fear that they'll over drink and we come to sometimes farmers separate the cow from the calf and monitor the calf's drinking well that's a good idea but we have we have the most natural and pure monitor mother we must trust in mother that you will only give what the calf needs and no more if the calf takes too much she will kick him away if the calf doesn't drink enough she'll make him come closer and practically force him to drink and she is a monitor so let him drink his fill until he vomits even even a mother who's breastfeeding her child will feed the child exactly every two hours and let him drink let the child belch and then this child will sleep and most of the time in the early stages the child will vomit and when we first see this we go oh my god the child's vomiting bleeding over it it's going to his eye because you know <laughs> our experiences of vomiting that we remember are very horrible and we don't want to relive them again it's true i can't i can't work with one hand hmm. So when we see the child vomit, just as we see a baby calf vomit, we go, oh no, big problem. Oh God, we go, no, babies are always going to vomit. That's what babies do. They vomit. They drink milk and vomit. And mommy licks it up and goes, oh, don't you really vomit. So let the baby vomit. Let the baby drink as much as he wants. Let the mother monitor. And yes, it's all good. It's all good. Do a bit of limbo. It's all good for you as well. Wind your knees and ankles. Let them drink. Let them drink. Let them drink. Harry, fish, 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 fish,